An internal condom, also known as the female condom, is a double-ended tube-like sheath with two rings on both ends, with one end open and the other thicker end closed. The thick closed-ended side is placed inside the vagina or anus and holds the condom in place, while the open side remains outside the vagina or anus. When in place, it acts as a barrier from contact with body fluids from your sexual partner, therefore preventing pregnancy and transmission of STIs. Most internal condoms are made of polyurethane, which is suitable for those with latex allergies. However, alternatives made of nitrile or latex are also available. Just like any other condom, the internal condom is easy to use. The first step is to check the condom packaging to ensure that it is not expired and has no TERS. Then, carefully remove it from its wrapper and identify the outer and inner rings. This is an important step that ensures that you place the condom correctly. Using the thumb and forefinger, squeeze the sides of the inner ring to bring both sides together, and then insert it gently into the vagina or anus. The inner ring should rest against the cervix before vaginal sex. Therefore, during insertion, this end should be pushed inside as far as possible. Ensure the open-ended side of the condom fully covers the vaginal opening and the condom is not twisted. When in place, it will cover the labia as well. Once everything is in place, guide the erect penis of your partner into the open side of the condom. If during sex you feel the penis slip between the walls of your vagina and the condom, or if the outer ring slips into the vagina, pause to adjust the condom. You can also choose to wear a new one. After intercourse, remove the internal condom by twisting the outer ring to enclose the contents, then gently pull it out. Wrap it in tissue and discard it in a garbage bin or pit latrine. While internal and external condoms are both effective options, they shouldn't be used together because friction between the two can cause tearing. When used correctly, internal condoms are approximately 95% effective at pregnancy prevention. Using them in combination with a spermicide will increase their effectiveness. The advantages of this method include double protection against sexually transmitted infections and pregnancies. It can be inserted up to eight hours before a sexual encounter, giving the user autonomy over their body. However, remember to change condoms after every sexual act. Since the outer part covers most of the external genitalia, the internal condom can also be used as a dental dam during oral sex to prevent transmission of STIs. During vaginal intercourse, the outer ring can stimulate the clitoris and add extra pleasure. These condoms are compatible with both water and oil-based lubricants. Unlike external condoms, no special storage is needed for internal condoms because they are resilient in humid conditions. Disadvantages of internal condoms include the fact that they are a high-effort method that requires consistent and correct usage to prevent pregnancy. Incorrect usage lowers their effectiveness to 79%. They may come with reduced sexual sensitivity, and some internal condoms may be squeaky during sex. Compared to external condoms, they may be harder to find in some countries, and generally less affordable. However, these disadvantages do not outweigh the advantages that come with using this method, since when used correctly, it offers dual protection from both pregnancy and STIs. Learn more about the internal condom and other contraceptive methods by visiting findmymethod.org.